Okay, so what's happening now is I've decided that I am going to sit here right now in this chair. I'm gonna beat the no restart challenge. I'm just gonna sit here and beat it. That's the deal. I don't care if the microphone glitches and you can't hear me anymore. I don't care how crappy the microphone quality sounds. I just want to document me beating this, bro. What the heck? How did I not hit him? Oh, I forgot you were here. Bro, really? Ah! What? No retrying level speed. All of them in a row. It's the most time-consuming challenge. I like how it gives you little flashes of, like, little text if you get a headshot. It's completely pointless. It does not do anything, but it feels cool. Ugh. There's a gun right in front of you. Why didn't you grab it? Bop, 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 bop. That's how I always start this level. That's a pretty easy level once you get past the beginning. Really gotta know what to do at the beginning. Grab this. Blah. Story. Blah. Right. Boom. That's a pretty hard level. It was it was pretty hard the first time I played the game. How did you not die? Alright, this level screwed me over quite a few times with this guy and his shotgun. What? Uh, two people at once. That guy has scared me a couple times too. There's one more guy that we never see coming. There he is. This level is a nightmare. This is a very, very ridiculous problem. Just gotta get close enough to one of them while dodging an insane amount of bullets. Oh! Dang it! Okay, just know that when I said I'm gonna sit down in this chair and beat No Restart Challenge, I didn't mean I would stay there until I beat No Restart Challenge. But I will keep recording myself trying to beat this. I'm probably gonna cut most of it out because most of it is gonna be not me not talking, not trying to be funny, not acting like I'm actually making a YouTube video. I'm just gonna play the game and I'm gonna keep in the whole run where I beat the, the challenge. Oh. What the free That happened last time. Whoa! Holy crap! <laughs> that scared the crap out of me. I always look right at the bullets whenever they go right next to me. I think that your character model is like actually a flat plane, and you have a better chance of dodging bullets if you go right in between them, like a like the the bus from Harry Potter. Oh my god. Am I drunk? No, underage drinking is illegal, and I am, in fact, underage. Surprise, motherfucker! <gasps> what the heck? We killed each other! I haven't gotten into the game yet. I haven't- I haven't fully immersed myself yet. Super. Oh, God! I need to take more time. I need to just take more time. I can do like a vibrato effect. I'm an immature child. You can kill pop up people. Blah, 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 blah. You're never gonna know what I was gonna say. Well, maybe you could if you put together the context clues. Where's his gun? 
Um, there it is. Why? How did it get over there? It, oh, oh, I see you. Peekaboo. Bah! Hoo ha! Hoo ha! I want to save that shotgun for the shotgun guy. Okay, shotgun guy. No, what the heck? I need to just stop to look around. I just need to be more observant. You can click to make time pass, but like it's useless if you're if you're holding a weapon. There should be a way to do that. Okay, I'm going to I'm going to stop recording once I get like a really good run. I kind of want to try that on the red guys. Ow! Gosh! Dang it! God! Uh... Okay, so this is a pretty good run. Oh, I can get the shotgun guy right away. Well, maybe I shouldn't. Maybe I don't want to. This guy, I'm gonna go for that guy. Only one guy left. Boom! Oh! <laughs> 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 Oh crap, I missed. Since when do I miss? Punch. What? I didn't know it was there! I did I really need to pause to just look around sometimes. I'm gonna just test out one of these darts. Okay, they don't kill. Who knew that a first person shooter could involve so much strategy? Like, not just like, oh, where should I go? Where's the best hiding spot? Like, should I shoot this guy or this guy, or, or should I throw my gun at this guy or shoot this other guy? Is he just he's chilling there? He's just... Are you gonna move, or... He's waiting for me to get close to him so he can give me a freaking shotgun sandwich. I have a katana, dude. I wouldn't try it. I- That was possibly the most awkward thing that's ever happened to me in this game. I feel very lucky right now. Oh, oh no! DIRECTLY INTO THE BULLET! Just in case this is the victory run, I'm, tr I'm gonna try not to say anything stupid so that I don't have to cut it out. Because if I- if I have to cut something out of the final victory run, that's kinda- that's kinda stupid. That's gonna kinda ruin it. So I'm just gonna not say anything so that I don't accidentally say something stupid, you know what I mean? Because on my last run, I mean, I deleted the recording because I, I failed, but on my last run, I, um, I said something stupid. It wasn't, like, offensive or anything, but it was just a dumb thing that not a lot of people would find funny, so I, I would have cut it out if it was the final victory run, and that would suck. People would hate that. People are going to be like, what did he say there? Uh. I missed? How do you miss in this game? You have as much time as you need to aim. <sighs> you only need to punch that guy once. I just never- I just- I just have a feeling that one- like one time out of a hundred he's just gonna- he's not actually gonna fall and die. He's gonna actually get back up. And I know- I think the game is, like, scripted for him to fall in there and die, but, like, what if he didn't one time? What if he didn't? You know? Oh my god. Look at this guy. This guy is crazy! You know what I think would be really fun? If you, like, if there was a game mode where you would- Fighter, it was just like one red guy. It's just a one level with one red guy, and then like 
you restart the challenge. Well, like, it's a bunch of the same level, but every level is just like... Like, when- after you play the first level, it like records what you do. And then the second level, you um, you fight that recording of yourself. So it's like you're fighting your ghost. And then this repeats, you fight your old ghost and your old ghost and your old ghost until you're just fighting yourself over and over and it gets harder and harder. That would be really cool. Or like, if, if like, you were still fighting an AI in every level, but each level the AI would learn more about how you, you do. That would be cool. Or like, the AI can't do anything while you're like not moving and time isn't moving, but it can still think of what to do. That would be interesting. Oh! I hate when they like, you can see them getting ready to punch. Because it's like, oh crap, I'm gonna die in a little bit. Like, watch. Watch. Like, when a guy that does that, when you can see their fist going back and they're like, oh man, I'm about to punch you. It's like, the game's punch system is kind of inconsistent. You don't know exactly when you're gonna get, you're gonna get punched. The guy starts punching at you. I missed both times. Four times! Three times! I don't know, I can't count. Let's pick it up, bro. Bro, just pick it up. I feel so stupid right now. Can you kill this guy for me? You were supposed to kill him for me, but you didn't. Is the shotgun ammo consistent? Because like sometimes, I feel like sometimes it's two and sometimes it's three. I'm gonna, this time it was three, I'm gonna see if it can be two sometimes. If I even get a chance to have a shotgun. I'm glad I know that I'm getting better at this, because... Like... The average level I get to is- has gotten higher. Like, you- like, I used to, like, only get to about this level. Like, for most of my runs. But now, like, I can get a little further. And, like, if I'm really good, I can get to, like, 65%. And if it's, like, the best run ever, I can get to 80%. And that's my high best. That's my personal best. High best. That's how you say English. I'm not gonna cut that out. I'm just gonna- I'm just gonna- Just gonna leave it in. Imagine someone who had one of these guns that like, just straight up rapid fire. <laughs> Like, what if someone had that gun, but they were, like, able to aim every single bullet? It, like, shot like but they were aiming a completely different place every single time if, if it shot. Bro, that guy's not normally smart enough to, to back off. Usually he just tries to shotgun at me like that. That's what that guy- what I just get, did to that, that one guy, that's what that guy usually did. But this time, he was smart. I hate when that happens. Alright, one more guy, one more guy, one more guy, one more guy. You never know where he's coming. Come here, buddy. Come here, bud. Come on, bud. Super.
I'm just gonna act like I'm not gonna beat it so I can say whatever I want without worrying about having to cut it out. Because I hate cutting things out of something that, like... I hate cutting things out of something that should be, like... That you should see the entirety of it. For example, the entire victory run of me beating uh, this, this challenge. This guy just shotgunned his own guy. This guy is freaking... Bop! You need to think about where you're aiming, bud. You know what would really suck in first-person shooter games? Like... Like... In freaking, like, the... In FPS games, there's like... In ones... In ones where there's like a, a team mode, where like, you have a team, and you gotta defeat the other team, and stuff like that. You want, it would really suck if you could shoot people on your own team. It, it would really suck if people if it allowed that. Like in uh in Big Paintball, that's a Roblox game. It's very very good. In Big Paintball, there's a there's a there's a team death match mode, TDM. Uh, and in it, you just gotta shoot a bunch of people on the other team that's with, like you don't even have to defeat them you just gotta shoot as many people on the other team as you can and it doesn't even matter who shoots the other people the most you just gotta get a lot of money the game doesn't allow you to shoot people on your own team and it would be really weird if you could but like that would it would also be realistic It's hard, like, I feel bad for game developers where they have to choose between being realistic or being fair. Because, like, if you could- <gasps> That scared me so bad! <clears throat> I'm sorry, I just forgot what I was gonna say. Not even gonna worry about it. Oh crap. Oh no, what do you do? Oh my god. In another universe, I would have died right there. I wonder if it's possible for a, sur uh, for a person to survive this situation in real life. That would really suck. Crap. Oh man. Oh man. Oh! Just barely. Oh my god. I hate when that happens. So much. All right, here we go. Now we're now we're doing it for real. Now things are happening. I like how that one guy that appears up there that I just killed. I like how like when you kill him, he he's placed perfectly so that he drops his gun over the edge. Like here you go, you can have this because it doesn't matter anymore because I'm dead. Is this the last guy? It's the last guy. Super. Holy crap! This is like, well, I'm not even gonna say how good this is because like, I don't want to jinx it, and I don't believe that. Jinxing is a real thing. I don't think that it's real. Like, I just... It's just a concept made up by humans that isn't actually true, but we just pretend that it is, even though we all know it's not true. This guy just caught a bullet to protect his friend. I was trying to shoot at that guy, but a guy appeared right in front of him. He actually blocked him. Didn't know we were playing freaking Mr. President. All right. Bop. Just don't give them a chance to shoot at you. If they give you a chance to shoot at- if you give them a chance to shoot at you, then you just- you just- you're forced to dodge it. And so, like, 
then you don't have time. Then you have to constantly be thinking about dodging and not just shooting. And it makes it a lot harder. So just try to shoot them as fast as you can before they get a chance to shoot at you. This would suck in real life, by the way. Two guys with freaking fully automatic guns. What the heck? I didn't know that was the end of that level. This That level's shorter than I thought. I can hot switch now. Holy crap. Bop! Bop! Hot switch ready. I don't know what I- I don't know when I should use hot switch and when I shouldn't. In this kind of situation, you should probably like... Throw a gun at one guy, and then... Wait, what? I didn't- <clears throat> Throw anything, anything at all, at a guy that you want to hot switch into, so that they drop their weapon, if they have a weapon. And that way, it should be right in front of you when you hot switch into them. Because they just dropped it. And you can just pick it up. Because if you hot switch into somebody with like that gun, I'll use them as an example. They have to drop it. So it sucks. Bah! That guy mega died. He's mega dead. Like all the way dead. And there's a guy here. I remember one time I forgot he was there and then he shot right past me and I barely survived. It was the scariest thing on the entire planet. This is a really interesting map because like, you can shoot- Like you're shooting all over the place. There's guys everywhere. There's no place where there's where there couldn't be a guy. And now I choose to hot switch into this guy. That's it. Holy crap, dude. We're going all the way. This is the last level I've gotten to in this challenge. So I'm kind of screwed. I think I'm screwed on this one. It's just cramped. And like, you just, it's, it sucks, you know? It's, it's just, this, like, this level is like the perfect amount of inconvenience. Like, this guy, this guy can totally go backwards so that he can dodge my bullet. But he doesn't, so, well, I'm, I'm just, he didn't do what I, the, what I imagined he would do. But like he could, and that would be bad. And like you, you cannot see. Whoa! Like look at, look, look at all of these guys. Where did they come from? You just not. You're never quite sure how many guys there are, so you don't know if you should be hot switching or not. Hot switching to this guy. Holy crap, that was very, very good. Huh! All three at once. Holy crap, never gotten past this point. Totally not ready. Oh my god. Holy crap. I totally... At, from, from now on, we're just improvising. We're just doing whatever. I feel like... I feel like... To really do this challenge, you really gotta... You really gotta... You really gotta just know the levels. Like... I feel like I haven't done this yet, but I've been considering it. Maybe I should just like... Try practicing the levels. Like, just going into the level select and practicing some of them. Because like, that can really help. Because if there's one level that you haven't gotten past, even though, it, like, you keep getting to it, but you just never get past it, you should probably just practice it, you know? Super. Oh, I can't believe this. I cannot believe it. This is the craziest run I've had yet. Grab this. 
Oh my god, I can imagine another universe where I would mess that up. Holy crap. One shotgun at a time. I'm out! So the, the shotgun, we answered the question that I asked 500 years ago. The shotgun can run out of ammo faster than normal. What I mean is the shotgun can, the shotgun ammo amount is not consistent. Sometimes it can be, sometimes it can be two, sometimes it can be three. I don't know if it can, if it, if it could be more or less than that. I could imagine this game would do something like that where it would just give you a shotgun but it only had one ammo. The literal, the literal concept of the game is that you totally, you're in a very unfair scenario, but you have one advantage, and that is you can manipulate time, and that gives you the ability to get out of any scenario you want. But like, how far can you go with that? Like, there's a challenge where every gun has one ammo. Like, like, I just shot at somebody. Now I have to throw it at someone. Bam. I'm, there's nothing else you can do. It's your only choice. Crap. This game... I swear, this game looks way, way easier than it actually is. But so, so much insanely easier than it actually is. It's just crazy. It's just crazy, you know? I forgot which buttons threw the katana and which one actually used it. Maybe I should hot switch right now, oh my god. Okay, this insane mirage of bullets is over so I can move. I can move around, I can go. I can go do stuff. Don't think about victory. Think about doing the right thing. If you get too focused on victory, you're gonna make irrational deci decisions. You're gonna get really nervous. You're gonna start acting weird. Super. Oh, that's it? Wow, okay. I did it? No way, I did it! We admire your dedication. Okay, press escape from med menu. But there's like one more challenge, right? Fun, fun, fun. Play game, get fun. Okay, I'm just gonna stop recording right now so I can find-